Hi everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how we can navigate to the portal view of the incident form. So when I say portal view of the form in portal, I am not referring to the record producer for example like the one we have seen in my previous video report an issue or maybe create incident which helps us to create an incident in the backend but I'm talking about the actual portal view uh, which is uh, also there in the backend but when we submit let's say our record producer we are navigated to the ticket form not actually the portal view of the form so for example uh, i have opened this uh, report and issue record producer which we created in our previous demo so let's say i select some categories over here and i select a sub category as well i am entering some test description if i submit this so this navigates me to the ticket view of the incident form uh, and let me open this uh, incident form in the platform view as well. Now the view that opens up in front of me is the default view. If I have to go to the portal view, I am going to select view and then the service portal. So this is actually my service portal view and this is not my portal view because here i can only see the activity and the attachments and if i have to open that portal view over here what i'm going to do is i will have to let's say uh, i open this uh, i navigate to the home page now i look for that incident this is the one right so let's add some short description Uh, okay, I'm not going to assign it to anyone. I'm simply going to save it along with a short description so that I have a more clarification of what I'm looking for to the test incident is the short description I gave. So let me click on this one. And now it navigates back to the same ticket view which opened up when I submitted that uh, record producer. Now if I have to go back to the portal view of the form, in the portal itself what I am going to do is instead of id equals to ticket in the URL, I will change it to id equals to form. So this is the actual portal view of the form inside the portal itself where also I have access to every related list which is available on the incident form and if I have to update something let's say I want to update the short description I can update it from here and it will still be saved though there is no direct navigation available from the home page itself so this is how we can navigate and we can configure a widget maybe on the home page which leads us to such kind of a form and you can also see that the view is SP so view is very important when you're opening up this kind of a link in the portal because you only want to show your users the service portal view of the form when it comes to the portal side of things. So in my next video we will also see how we can uh, simplify the ticket form to include the forms, uh, form page of the portal view. So thank you so much for watching. Bye.